Salerno served as a consigliere, underboss, and acting boss of the Genovese family. By the 1960s, Salerno controlled the largest illegal numbers racket in New York, generating an annual income of around $50 million. He operated primarily from the Palma Boys Social Club in East Harlem and continued his criminal activities in these areas. The FBI accused him of leading a network of bookies and loan sharks that generated $1 million in profits each year. Salerno enlisted the services of Roy Cohn as his attorney. In April 1978, he was sentenced to six months in federal prison for charges related to illegal gambling and tax evasion. Following his release in early 1981, Salerno suffered a minor stroke and retreated to his Rhinebeck estate to recover. At the time of his stroke, Salerno held the position of Genovese underboss. After recovering from his stroke and the death of Frank Thierry, the front boss of the Genovese family, Anthony Salerno assumed the position. However, it was widely known within New York Mafia circles that 